now what I want to do is I want to give more gravitas to what I just said. Okay? This is about the 19th Emir. And the way I came about this one was not through the 19th Emir, but then again I noticed that this 19th Emir actually generates these numbers here. Okay? And so how does it generate? The 19th Emir is actually 359. Okay, we've known this for a long time. Emir is a, is a prime number, which is if you write it backwards, it's also a prime number. The Emir of 359 is 953. And 953rd composite is 1143, which is 9 times 127. Okay? And we know that Surah 9 has 127 verses. We've known this before. Okay? But what we didn't know is that 359 also happens to be the index of composite 446, which in turn is in the index of composite 548. But 548 additive prime is again 9127. Okay? So this is the index of the index. So through the index of the index, what we are doing is we are generating, again, Chapter 9, having 127 verses. And then recall that 548 composite is 670. We've known this before. And 670th verse in the uninitial surahs is 9127. Okay? So, so when, we, when we go to... Go to... Chapter 9... Chapter 9, 127, we see that there's a number there, the second number, plum, okay, color is plum, I think, okay. 1362 is the sequ sequential number of verses from the beginning of the Quran to this, this one, to this 9127, okay. And the number of verses in the uninitial surahs, okay, happens to be 670. And so that 670 is not by accident because that 670 is being generated. Okay. It's being generated right here because its index is 548 and it's a composite and its index is 548, but 548 after the problem is also 9127. So you see the coincidence of those two in here. 670, 9127, 670, 9127, 670, 9127. Okay. This is how God has designed the Quran. This is why we have to take it to heart, make it, make it a way of living. We made mistakes in the past. If we were irresponsible in using the blessing that God had given us, Remember Joseph. Okay? Those paradigms are in the Quran. We did those things. We have to ask God for forgiveness. Okay? If we use those blessings that God gave us irresponsibly, then pay attention. We made, we made foolish decisions. Okay. Then we have to, we have to, we have to ask God for forgiveness. We have to humble ourselves in front of God because God is telling us, look at these numbers. Look at these numbers. This is God's design. Let's do that. Let's ask God for forgiveness. Then let's repent to Him that you will not do that again. There's a grand design for those feelings and those privileges that God has given us. And we cannot abuse them. Okay? We have 
have to ask God to help us not to abuse them. If we abuse them, we are going to be in trouble. Okay? So I'm going to stop here and we'll, we'll go ahead and finish our Jummah, Allahul Kabir.